Hey, what's up everyone? It's me, Compass, and today I'll be raiding your pet fails again in my Discord. So, of course, we got the first one, and honestly, looking at it, that's kind of a rough fail. Uh, what I think he was trying to go for was proof, most likely. Uh, sadly, he got Storm Ward. Um, I understand why this is a fail. Yeah, you could say you could socket proof, but you really need that double resist when you're going for pets like this. Um, really nice make aspect though. You're very, very close. Honestly, it's not too bad of a fail. I'd probably give it like a 3 out of 10. It's not the worst. It's actually not bad. Honestly, I'd use it. Uh, I'd probably socket proof. Not the worst, not the best, but it's somewhat, you know, still very usable. And next one we got from Mind of Horseshoe. Um, that is rough. Oh my god. Imagine that, like, out of nowhere, you're making a myth pet and you just get Death Dealer. It's always so strange when you get pets like this, you know? Um, oh my god, yeah, no, honestly, that's painful to look at. Uh, looks like you're going for the uh, triple crit, triple damage pet a little while ago when that was uh, really good for PvE. Um, but yeah, looking at it now, like, oh my god, that's so painful, man. I'll give that a 5 out of 10. Yes, it's still usable, but like... You wouldn't use this. You'll straight up retrain. This is just terrible, bro. I feel bad for you, my man. The next one is from Ita. Basically, he's got a leaf foot. And it got balance ward. I'm guessing that's a fail. I'm not too sure, though. Seems like balance ward is the fail. First of all, the stats are very, very off. Um, the thing is, I, 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 I'm, I'm, I roll with 9 dealer, right? 9 dealer is fine. But if I, if I have 9 proof, I'm remaking that pet. No shot I'm using that. I'm definitely remaking that pet. 9 proof. Already, I'm looking at your pet. And I'm going to give it a 2 out of 10. Because it's a very good support balance ward pet. It's got balance ward balance proof. I don't see anything wrong about it. Except for the stats. If the stats were 2.0, then I'd be like, yo, this is kind of nice. This is kind of wavy. You know, that's all I'm saying. But right now, looking at it, that is kind of rough. Just because of the numbers. But realistically, the stats it got, or the talents it got, is actually not too bad. He also put this pet fail with, I'm guessing crit is the fail. I'm pretty sure he's probably going for a triple double, then he sockets mighty already. Uh, nine dealer doesn't really matter too much. Um, and I'm looking at the sort of uh, talent right here, the little pedigree. So that's also nine proof, I believe. So that's also kind of rough, dude. Um, yeah, I mean, that's kind of bad. Yeah, you could socket proof, but I wouldn't. I'd probably just retrain. Proof is also a rare jewel, too. Yeah, I'm gonna give this, like, I'm gonna also give this, like, a 3 out of 10. It's still very easy. Well, still not too bad. It's just that, you know, just try to get 2.0 pets, you know? Like, PvE-wise, I, I try to get 2.0 pets. There's a lot of PvE pets. Um, but yeah, that that's just rough, honestly. And he also sent this Sun Serpent pet. And, of course, the fail is Bringer. <laughs> That's funny to look. I love looking at this. I don't know why. Like, I'm not dissing you anything. This is a really funny pet to look at. I look at just because, like, it's such a weird talent to get. Like, dude, that's such a nice... Uh, that was such a nice... Um, wait a minute. I just realized something. You're going for triple Maycast on a fire school pet. Are you support on your fire? Because this isn't really good for PvP unless it's 4v4s. This is fine for 4v4s. This is not too bad, not too good. This is not a PvE pet or a PvP pet for fire. So I don't know why you made that, but you know what? Bringer, that's rough. Honestly, I wish you got uh, Defy because that'd be kind of neat seeing a uh, fire support, but that is very strange. That is very, very strange. And Storm Titan puts in a bunch of pets. Holy crap, he's got a bunch of pets. I'm just taking the best one I found that he sent. And <laughs> this is a weird spell, or a weird pet. Fainting spell. That gives the faint item card, if I'm not mistaken. Unicorn make us pet rescue. Don't know what pet rescue is. Okay, I found a pet with pet rescue on it. This is a weird spell, holy crap. 25% healing, low HP. This is a very weird pet, dude. I've never seen this card before. We, 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 dude. Oh my god, I can't read. Revilitize. Um, whoa, that, that's a cool spell. Not gonna lie, like that's a cool looking spell. Yeah, it's really bad, I guess. Like 25% HP, eight. 
Uh, eight pips. Yeah, that's kind of bad, but this, that's a very cool spell. I'm gonna be honest. So actually, I was taking a look at the pets, the the opossums. I'm realizing defenders, rampart, and pet rescue are from the Gen One pool. And I'm looking at it. It's not even one. Like there's a bunch of these like sort of opossums. Defenders, uh, you know, see defender, rampart, pet rescue. I'm seeing a bunch of them. So. Something's off. So what I think you did, I think you took up. It's a kiosk pet. I just realized you found this in the kiosk. I don't know if you made this. I doubt it now because this is kiosk pet. Um, deca my decathlon pet. Huh. I don't think that's your pet, but a decathlon pet. This is a Gen One pet, right? The, the stats are really low. For, 40 will... I mean, yeah, you don't need stats on it. But normally, they wouldn't be this low. You wouldn't... Is, it, is this Gen 1? I was going to look at the wiki to see um, if I could find the pool. But looks like you can't even find the pool. You can't even get the pet. So, like, yeah, if I get a kookaburra and a possum and I hatch them, I can get this. But still, um, that's kind of weird. They don't have the talents here. It doesn't show the... The, the strength, all that stuff, because it's a hybrid. Next one's from Jacob. He said it's not his pet, but he thought it was funny. Um, yes, this is very, very funny because what is that? What is that? What is that spell? I've never seen that. Hold on, I'm gonna try to find that. So what I'm guessing, this is a polymorph elemental. I want to see what pets have that. There are no pets in the kiosk that have this. That's very strange. Wow, so you most likely got Polymorph Elemental. Yeah, that's super weird. Finding that in an Ice Dactyl pool? Um, I'm guessing that's Gen 1 or Gen 2, something like that. Like around there, like really, really early. Uh, that's probably Bringer. No, Epic. Um, that might be Giver. This might be Defy or pr most likely Proof. This might be Proof. This might be Giver. Because the stats are kind of low, so, you know, yeah. That's, that's of course crit. Thing is, you should have stopped once you got crit. And then you get this. That's such a weird spell, dude. That is so weird. Oh, yeah, I forgot to, like, rate them, like, uh, like how bad of a fail they were. But, yeah, next one from Cryo. And he was trying to go for quint damage, not complete fail. Yeah. Um, so... It, it did feel like epic though, so it's not too bad. Um, crit striker, it is the good crit. Not the best crit, but it's a good crit. Hmm. Of course, I'd give this a 1. Um, still very usable. You don't really need too much damage for PvE. Yeah, Quint's nice, but... You know, it's not really needed too much. Just... I don't know. That's just crazy though. I'm gonna be honest. Like... I've, I, I just realized... You, I've gotten this pet so many times. Exact same pool, exact same stats. I'm pretty sure, like nine dealer. Uh, I'm not sure about the pedigree, but I've had this pet before. I think I made this pet on three separate occasions where it failed with crit striker. Yes, I have. Yeah, I've gotten dealer. I've gotten giver. I've gotten bringer. Then I failed with crit striker. I'm pretty sure we probably got from the because uh, I I hatch from the kiosk sometimes. I got that pet from the kiosk. I'm pretty sure we probably clicked the same pet. And we got the same exact talents. I got this pet three times. I just realized. Yeah, that's crazy, dude. So, of course, Mercy's sending us some of his pets. This Ice Bird's crazy. I can already see that. Um, he's got this pet, Sleet Storm. Hmm. Of course, this is 2.0 stats. He just has a Tenacious or, or that's Rugged. That's Rugged. He has Rugged Socketed. So, the fail here is probably make that Sleet Storm. Um, and that's a rough fail, yeah. Uh, it's a very cool pet to get it on. The Grimoires, I love those Grimoire pets. Um, and I honestly see why you uh, probably got it on there. They look so much better than the frills. And on ice, you don't really need a frill. Um, but honestly, looks like a very, very... It, it doesn't look too bad. It's actually a very nice pet. Sleet Storm is actually not a bad talent. I like that talent. Yeah, it's a good talent. I feel like you could just socket Defy on this. And make a Sleet Storm, it could cast it, you know... I know in PvE, I had a Furnace pet, and it casted quite a bit. So, honestly, I don't think Sleet Storm is, like, too much of a rare cast in PvE. 
So that's not too bad. You know, I might have just realized you probably were using this pet for PvP. Because you just had this pet. If you're using this pet for PvP, then yeah, that's a rough fail. So I hate those little aura fails. I, I always get them. Uh, so if this is actually for PvP, uh, and you probably want a breaker most likely, then that's just rough. Next one's from Rebecca, and oh my god. Um, how did you get two pets, two polar foxes, with this? Wait, so the first one, it got Deer Knight. The first one got Deer Knight. A polar fox got Deer Knight a card. Then your second one got Maycast Hex? And then you you got the Purse Enchant? Um, wow. Wow, wow, wow. It is Gen 1, yes. I can see that's a Gen 1 pet. But that's still rough. I mean, yeah, there's no way it's gonna like, get anything good to Gen 1 pet, but uh, that's weird. Next one's from Noah's Shadow Flame. Looks like he was making a triple-double for Storm. Um... Yo, Maycast and Feeble, that's rough, dude. That is a rough talent to fail with Maycast and Feeble. You socketed that Pigsy Maycast. That's an interesting socket. Uh, Maycast and Feeble, this is Philosaurus PvE, you know. Um, that's a rough fail, I'm gonna be honest. Maycast and Feeble is kind of useless in PvE. Uh, realistically, it's not too bad of a pet. Yeah, you could use it, but you know, just retrain, you know. Like, I wouldn't even, like, waste any more time with this pet. Uh, this is just a rough fail. Thank you all for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Uh, if you want to send, send more pet fails, join my Discord down in the description. Uh, and send your pet fails in the pet fails tab. I'll be sure to make another video on them soon. And uh, please leave a like on the video and please subscribe. Uh, and sorry that I haven't been uploading as much recently. I just haven't been really having too much fun with the game. I've been trying to find, like, things to have fun with. Uh, but, you know, slowly and slowly, I've been trying to find things. And yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next video.